Hey, thanks for coming back to Forest Fires. Are you digging on my balloons up there? I love them. They're from a little party I had recently. The marble ones glow in the dark. Go get some, guys. You won't regret it. And I got some new branch lights back there for my bookshelf, too. So today I want to talk about additions and whether or not you care about which additions you have of books. I have some collections of, you know, where I get an author's entire catalog or I get a series, but sometimes in the past I didn't really pay attention to what I was buying. Sometimes there's not a good option and you're just stuck with some hideous glossy paperback or <laughs> Some of the things that I have are from back in the day, book fairs. Yeah, so I'm trying to update things so that I can have a pretty bookshelf because I care about that. It is my art. It is something I care about, so I want it to look nice. So before, you definitely saw on my shelf, I pointed them out, um, Jane Austen Vintage Classics. These are gorgeous. They have... Um, really pretty end papers that are from like this is Emma and Emma had the Northanger Abbey artwork on the inside so they kind of alternate them so if you read Emma before you know it's like about this thick well I also said I had ordered something really special that I was waiting for and that is flip backs <laughs> look at how tiny and how cute that it fits in my hand so these are read horizontally, and the cover flips back. Ha ha ha. The entire text is in here, so you can see, like, comparatively. <laughs> Teeny tiny. So that's going to look great with my Austin display on my new shelf when I get that from my dad or shelves. I don't know what I'm going to call it because it's one big piece. I guess it's shelves or shelf. I don't know. I'm rambling now. But I did get something new in. They are um, Puffin. I think Puffin Classics they're called. I don't know. I'll link it below. Um, this is The Adventures of Huckleberry Finn. And it's got river boats on it and their little their little boat and then the inside has a bird of some sort I haven't read this book in a really long time so I'm sure it's a reference it's hardback and then the other one is The Adventures of Robin Hood by Roger Lancelin Green didn't even know who that was by because I've never read it so obviously you've got like the castle and the woods and different woodland creatures. These are really pretty and there's um, a number of other classics that these come in and I'm going to gradually collect them as I see them um, on sale for a good deal. So what do you guys think? What about additions do you care about? Do you care about the format? Do you care about the artwork? Um... Do you care about any additional content, like um, introductions and things like that? Let me know in the comments below, and I look forward to sending out another video again soon. Bye!